Hey guys, welcome back to Techshon.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to configure the Xiaomi Mini Wi-Fi router. Since the router has a Chinese interface, it will be tough for you to know what is what and set it up correctly. So this video helps you through that process. First, let me go ahead and uh, connect this router to my uh, broadband internet line. Uh, the internet cable goes up here, so make sure you connect the internet cable here and uh, the password here. Let me, let me go ahead and uh, connect this to my internet and get right back to you. Alright, now we have turned on the router and uh, we have connected the uh, cable internet to the LAN WAN port. So it's completely on. You can connect the router to your PC or laptop via Ethernet cable or the moment you turn on, you'll get Wi-Fi uh, spots uh, of the uh, router, the default spots. Here, uh, as you can see, uh, I'm going to just connect it to a Wi-Fi spot and show you. But uh, you can either connect it, the router to the PC via Ethernet or a Wi-Fi. So here uh, we have two spots showing up. One is a, a 5 GHz band and one is a 2.4. Let me go ahead and connect to 2.4. The moment you connect it, yeah, it's connected. The moment you connect it, as you can see, it opens up a setup page. Or if you if it doesn't open up, you can always access it through 192.168.1.100 or depending on your gateway, which you can run uh, in CMD and the command is IP config. It will show you which uh, IP you need to use. Now the the setup process is the same for a Windows and Mac laptop, so there's no much difference. So here I'm using a Mac laptop. Terms and conditions. So let's click on the next. So it starts loading. Now, now this page is the login page where you need to enter your uh, internet's login and password. So I'm going to go ahead and enter my internet's login and password so that uh, I can show you. So we have your internet provider must have provided you with a username and password. So make sure you enter that here. All right, I've entered it and you need to click on the blue button. Now this page is where you set up your uh, Wi-Fi name. So I'm going to give it a name. And a password. Now hit next. It starts loading and shows up the next page. So that's pretty much it. And this page shows the uh, QR code where you can download the uh, you know the mobile app for the router. Since we have changed the uh, Wi-Fi uh, name, it starts to we need to go again and connect. So here you can see my Wi-Fi spot. I'm going to connect again and it's going to ask the password. So I'm going to hit the password and join. As you can see, uh, the hotspot is connected. I've connected to the Texan uh, hotspot that we created uh, while the setup process. And that's the process. It's done. You should be able to access the internet. I'm going to just type google.com and see whether I'm going to get... Yes, internet is loading, so that means the setup process is complete. Now, if you want to go into advanced features, let's go ahead into the router page. Just type in uh, mewifi.com and it should directly take you to the login page of uh, me. If you use Chrome, things are going to get easy because on the top, as you can see, it will show you the translate uh, button, which you can use to change the page, the Chinese page, to English. And that's it. You are now on English version of the page. This is nothing but enter. You need to enter your Wi-Fi uh, password, which I have set. I'm going to enter my Wi-Fi password, and I'm logged in. I'm on the uh, router setup page. The top. Let's hit translate. Let's translate the page to English. As you can see, it shows the connectivity and stuff. Router settings appear on the top. Now, using the Wi Fi settings tab, you can go ahead and uh, set change settings related to the Wi Fi. You can set individual settings for 2.4 GHz and the 5 GHz. Makes it easy. Now, the internet settings page is pretty simple. 
just go here and you can change settings related to your uh, internet connection you can see it's pretty clear here and uh, the security center gives you options to configure uh, uh, you know the password the routers password and stuff the LAN setting again gives you options to change the DHCP and the LAN IP if you're a pretty advanced user these settings will help you out but again if you're a basic home user you don't have to fiddle with all this it's going to just work the moment you enter your username and password from your internet provider unless and otherwise they have specific settings for you to configure you can go ahead and uh, you know modify the settings accordingly so it wasn't that easy guys so like I said just use this Google translator and uh, life should be easy so it's pretty simple so that's about it so hope this video was informative to know about how to configure the Xiaomi mini Wi-Fi router Thanks for watching. Stay tuned to TechShun.com for more such videos and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel.